Welcome to Minecraft, guys. This is going to be my tutorial for the Technic Pack. Just a basic introduction to get you guys up and running. There's a lot of mods here. I'm going to be detailing in the description the ones that I put on. I cut out a lot of what I consider the fluff, or at least stuff that I don't really enjoy in mine. Um, I'm going to be giving you guys a seed to work on, and it's also going to be the name of my world. It's going to be Technic Pack Love. They are capital on every word. If this works out right, I'm already going to know where some of the stuff is since I've already explored this world. And it's got a little bit of everything that I love in it. Here we go, booting up, and it looks just like what I was expecting. Nice little apple and orange tree over there. This spot itself ain't all that great, but what we can do is... Alright, I'm going to have all those little achievements to get rid of again. You may notice that wood takes a long time to break with your hands. That's because of one of the mods in here. Uh, it's worth it in the end. Right now, I'll just give you a quick demonstration of what one of these apple trees will give you. This is, of course, from Z's farming mod. And you're probably going to want to collect a couple of saplings from this sucker. Once I get rid of all the wood, that is. Okay, once we got all this. Let's turn that all into planks. Oh, look, I have too many items on. Turning that off for now. There we go. And look, we're already getting saplings and apples. Oh, goodness golly. Isn't that great? Okay, now I know what you're thinking. We should probably be making a uh, wooden axe. But the problem is that since I have single player commands on, that can be kind of uh, odd. Because single player commands use the wooden axe to denote locations. Let's just finish breaking this tree down and get some more apples. Okay, the way I usually head after this, oh look, three apples and enough saplings to get our own little orchard going if we want. I'd actually prefer avocados, I prefer them. Just, oh look, oil over in the distance, you're going to want that later. Now what I do is I usually come over here, oh look, coal, let's grab that first. There you go, early game coal, always good. Ah, uh, just the one piece, get that this time. Oh, well, I'm sure we'll find some more in a sec. Oh, look, a cave. I've never been here before. I don't know what's coming up. Of course not. Of course, we're going to need a little bit of stone just to get stuff going. Oh, look, copper. Nah, I can't break that yet. Don't get the right tool. Let's just get some stone going. Oh, look, more coal. What an odd coincidence. Now, I'm going to be playing on normal difficulty. I just kind of like getting bone and, you know, you're actually going to find a lot of uses for gunpowder because of the mods. But, you know, if you want to play on easy, that's just fine. If you want to pop open too many items and just start building, that's fine, too. I'm just going to show you how if you want to play, uh, I guess this would be hardcore style. And, you know, build your way up from the ground. This is how I do it, at least. You want to get that axe. Oh, I should have gotten one more piece of stone. I'm going to fix that in a second. In fact, I'll fix that right now. That stone down here? Nah, no, that's sand. Damn. Wasting your time. Your precious time. But hey, you're watching this. So, you know, at least I have an adoring public to pay some attention to. Me. Okay, let's get Another pick. Oh, I need some sticks first. Hey, while I'm at it, 
Why don't we just get this started? And you know what? I'm gonna leave that there. Okay, now one of the mods very early on, the tree capitator. Hey, look, all the wood and the saplings. Oh, oh, doesn't work on this tree. How come that? Oh, look, we already found some rubber. Another reason I like this seed. Now what you do is you make a tree tap using this pattern right here. Pick that sucker up. Now we're going to start looking for some little orange spots on the trunk. You're also going to want to break down these leaves because you're going to want to make your own farm with these trees in a bit. Oh, really? None at all? I'm getting disappointed in you. Uh, whatever. Let's break it down. It breaks pretty easy. If you're in a real bind, you can always use rubber wood to make three wooden planks. I wouldn't recommend it. There's going to be some stuff you can do later in the mod. Much better. Ah, there we go. Now you see when you use the tree tap, you get this little orange, yes, the resin. You're going to need that to make rubber. One of the things you can do, though, we're going to break this tree down anyway. You can see the little outline of where the rubber had been. If you hit it with your tree tap, there's a chance you'll get more rubber out of it. And hey, since we're going to be breaking the sucker anyway, why not? Of course, it burns through the tea tree tap pretty quick. You know, that's just a piece of wood. And there's the sapling. There we go. We want to get a couple more of those, though. We'll burn out this tree tap and get some sap on it. If we can find any of this damn tree. There we go. There we go. A lot of stuff to do on the first night. Probably gonna end up just digging a hole in a wall. Where is that sun? Oh, we're at midday. I'd really like to get a couple more saplings, so let's break down some trees right here. Oh, another thing about this mod, or one of the mods that I had you guys install, the nature mod, you're just going to find apples lying around randomly. Trees will replant themselves after you bust them down. I think it's you leave saplings lying around, so sometimes I do. See, look, that sapling planted itself. I don't know where it came from, but who cares? Hey, another rubber tree, uh, another rubber tree sapling. There we go, there we go. Okay. Uh, more rubber over here. Why don't we just... There we go. We've completely burned out our pick. Hmm. What else should we be getting early on? Ah, well, oh, we got that apple. Now, I always like to start off ooh, more rubber, in the desert. I don't know. Probably because I don't like the rain. And I mean, look. We haven't even started. We already got eight pieces of the food. We got some rubber. We got plenty of wood and we can get more if we want it. Oh, another part of this mod, I haven't really discussed, mini-map up in the top right, you hit tab. Oh, look, even more stuff to look at. Isn't that lovely? Isn't that glorious? Now, if I remember correctly where I set up my base, I'm going to be looking for a volcano. And I know what you're saying, there's no volcanoes in Minecraft. Oh, look, salt. Don't want it. Keep going. Take care of this tree while we're over here. Gosh, now I'm all confused. Look, more oil off in the distance. You're going to love that later. Ah, while we're running by, let's grab this sugar cane. Sugar cane plants itself in a part of the nature mod. Pretty useful. At least I think so. Now, there was a very nice little spot in the desert that I enjoyed. This kind of looks like it right over here. But for some reason... We didn't get the volcano that I'm used to. Must have been one of the mods I didn't install this time. Ah, well, I didn't really need the volcano anyway. Guess it was kind of cool to have it. But yeah, this is most definitely a spot I remember. Uh, part of that is this is a nice little spot over here. That huge oil spill over there in the distance, that black spire. I'll show off oil in a bit. Right now, gathering a little more wood so we can make our house tonight. Um, we got this little sinkhole right here. It's actually a little bit of a surprise to this farm. Yep, yep, yep. Another one of those things that I found while I was exploring before. Um, now, I 
know there's some iron in this bit under here. And that's why I grabbed it. But then again, I really should be making a house right about now. Can't help. Just digging it out a little bit there, making nice and pretty for later. Okay. So this is where I usually start off. I always like a little bit of an ocean. You get that nice oil well over there. Another one over there. That's probably going to disappear because of the nature mod planting some trees on top of it. But that's okay. And we're almost at sunset. So we make a couple of stacks. I know I should have made some charcoal, but whatever. Get a little house going. Now, I didn't find any sheep on the way here. Um, there's usually sheep in that little evergreen forest over there, but... Uh, this is one of those times when I think that uh, a little bit of cheating goes a long way, if you know what I mean. So I'm gonna be bending the rules a little bit in just a second. After I get the house up, of course. Because with the dock coming, I'm really not in any sort of a mood to screw around. Hooray, I made a crafting bench. I thought I already did that, but whatever. And we got a door, and we got a floor, and I think that was a pretty damn good first day. Now, no wool. What are we going to do? Oop. Where did that menu come from? Now you just hit all, uh, what is it, control and O, and it will bring this up. Let's see if we can figure out where the bed is. As you can see, there's a lot of stuff in this mod, and you got to remember, I kind of cut down on all that stuff, because I thought it was a little overwhelming. Hey, for some reason, all that mo creature stuff is still here. I thought I didn't install that. Maybe I did just for the bunnies. Mm, it's in here somewhere. Oh, I'm already losing my place. Where is that bed? There we go. We grab one bed, put it down. Might as well demonstrate Somnia while I'm here. You see, you get this little nice thing. You can choose if it'll reset your spawn or not. I want to spawn here, so I'm going to keep that on. And then you start sleeping. You get a nice little counter telling you just how fast you're going. It simulates the world where you're sleeping. Oh, it's simulating it really slow. I wonder if that's my recording program being a little rambunctious. I don't think that Fraps and Somnia play well together. That's bad. Hmm. Well, what I'm going to do is I'm going to end this hit, uh, the mod for right now. I'll probably prep up some stuff, build a nice little factory so I can show you some of the pieces you're going to be working with. Thanks for watching this first part of the tutorial, guys, and have fun.